All right, folks, Tim here from High End Cheap Tech, and we're going to talk about yesterday's uh, OnePlus 7 Premiere. Turns out it, it didn't turn out as bad as I thought. I had to watch a whole bunch of reviews on it. But it really kind of turns out that OnePlus didn't really have shit this year. Let's get to the intro and we'll talk about it and I'll explain. So I'm back as promised. Uh, so the OnePlus 7 Pro came out yesterday. Curiously, we didn't get the OnePlus 7 itself. We got the bigger overpriced one which is not going to make oneplus users happy and i'll point out what i consider downsides and it turned out to be not as horrible of a night last night as i thought i ended up watching like three hours of videos of reviews and every one of these guys was reading from the same script they had a free one and asbyt let it slip he had the phone for two weeks two weeks uh, and I'm going to assume everyone else did so whatever you saw you know as far as the unboxing went occurred probably the day they had it because they, there was some strange stuff yesterday that you don't normally see with a release and it, I think it was just to detract from the fact that the one plus the only plus is the price went up uh, yeah, they got rid of the notch. I applaud them for that. The reviewers act like the notch is new. It's not. Or the pop-up camera is new. Uh, it's been around for a while. On Vivo phones. And Realme now has a phone, not the Realme X with one. Oppo has a pop-up. Oh, wait, that's all the same company. Huh? Really? Hmm. One pluses are geared towards North America and Europe. Uh, so. The weird stuff. Dave 2D. He does a, a quick unboxing or first impressions. Or what he called it the underwater uh, test. He immediately drops his phone in water. Well, that's obviously came with the marching orders on the phone. Ah, uh, it's not even IP rated. It held up for quite a few minutes. It, it didn't die. Uh, but it, you know, it was not like, oh, it's got the best cameras. It doesn't. So that's not an improvement. It has the fastest face unlock no longer because you got to wait for the little pop-up camera. The in-screen fingerprint reader is still good, but I'm, I'm a big fan of, you know, set your phone face down. Oh, we got to have a case on it to do that. You know, so there's a lip to lift the screen off, whatever you're setting it on. And then you pick it up, touch the fingerprint reader, and by the time you turn it over, uh, and it has a beautiful glass back. Question is, why? Ain't got no wireless charging. And you could still do wireless charging through a polycarbonate, a.k.a. plastic back. Uh, you could. They're cutting costs, but they're still into the Samsung range. Uh, so... This release is kind of a blah, that's all. All I can say, if you're interested in the fastest processor, okay, you want the Snapdragon 855, uh, or the, you know, whatever Huawei's is, the 980, whatever, um, Kieran, but... Other than that, 
This one was a, a real, like, dud. Get yourself a Google Pixel 3a or a 3a XL. It's got a little bezel at the top. You'll live. Bezels won't kill you. Only reviewers will kill you by their constant droning on about, in today's world, we need bezel-less. Why? You know, just the way it is. But, the Google Pixel 3a is going to give you the Google camera. And it's going to match this camera on almost every level. Okay, it doesn't have the wide angle and yeah. <sighs> All kinds of crap that most people don't need. Uh, it'll do what it, you need it to. Oh, it's got a slower processor. Who cares? If you can't wait three tenths of a second. I can't imagine why you can't wait three tenths of a second for an app to open. Uh, I don't know. It doesn't have enough RAM. What are you doing running 42 apps on a smartphone? It's a freaking phone. Get a real computer. And uh, that's all I got for t today. Buy the Google Pixel 3a, folks. Do yourself a favor. Save yourself a boatload of money. Go to Best Buy and get one for like $2.99. It might be a little smaller if you want the bigger one. You're going to be paying up near... 400 some but you're still going to be well below the one plus not have a mechanical camera popping up that you could possibly you know go to set it down let's say you get like a desk like i have with the slide out keyboard and i want to set it down next to the mouse and i accidentally hit that uh, camera and now there lies my camera over in my trash can uh-oh yeah Catch you in the next one. Uh, check out that Google Pixel 3a one I did recently. I'll link that in the description below. And at the end, up in one of those corners. Thanks for watching. Later.